Hi, my name is John Stage and this is Dude Food. Today we're going to make a barbecue version of a shepherd's pie. Let's get going because we got a lot to do here. We got two things going on at once. We're going to do the uh, ground beef, onions, peppers, barbecue, and we're going to make a cheese sauce. So we're going to be jumping back, so watch out. Okay, we're going to put a little oil in this pan. Over here, we're going to put a little butter. This is going to be our cheese sauce. So let's get half the onions here. Half the onions over here. So the onions are going to cook with the butter. These onions are going to cook in the oil. We're going to take half the green peppers here and then half the green peppers here. Let's season it up. A little salt. Pepper. Pepper. All right, so let me spin a few things around. This one is going to be more delicate. Let's get the garlic in this one. And the garlic in this one. So now, they're both in the same place. We're, we're sweating out the onions, sweating out the peppers. We're not looking to brown either one of these. We're just looking to, to cook it through. The only problem with this dish is it's really filling. I mean, this, this can be a belly buster, but just, you know, you don't have to eat this much. Just eat, eat a little bit. All right, I like what's happening here. These will continue to cook as we add the ground beef. Again, let's season this up. Just a little more salt. Some pepper. And then we're going to break this up. As we're paying attention over here. Now we're going to tie it all together with a little bit of flour. And this is called a roux. Beautiful. And we're going to start slowly adding half and half. All right. I'm going to let that cook and just thicken up a little bit. But I'm just going to get a little of this grease out of the pan, just a little bit. All right, now we're going to add the barbecue sauce. I'll bring this down a little bit. We're just going to add enough sauce to really just coat this. We're going to put this in a casserole pan. You want to just get that initial steam out of there. Any big clumps, get rid of them. Beautiful. All right, leave that alone. So we're going to add the cheese right now. Now we're using cheddar and my secret weapon, uh, Reggio Parmesan. You can use Monterey Jack. That's got a great melting point. Let's liven this up. I love putting mustard in the cheese sauce. Now we're going to put a little bit of, well actually a lot, of Reggio Parm. This is where you're going to get that good pop. Salt, black pepper, and I just love to put a little Tabasco in there. Next, noodles. You can use elbows, you can use small shells. Hell, I don't care if you put spaghetti in here. It, it's all going to work out. And again, we did this in advance, so don't be afraid to cook your pasta. And it's one less step. Let's see. Really nice. I'm not just going to dump it. I'm going to be, I'm going to be correct about this. So now you layer this on top. Man, this is some serious decadence right here. That's enough. That's good right there. Now we're going to take the rest of the grated cheese as if this needs more cheese, but we're gonna, I like the way it looks on top. And we're gonna put this in the oven. Oh man, it's a crazy dish right here. All right. We've been, uh, we've been at this about 30 minutes right now. And that looks good. We're going to want to let this rest probably about 15, 20 minutes. We already did one, and this thing's been resting about 20 minutes now, so let me get that. OK. 
Okay. Scoop this out. A little of this goes a long way. Oh yeah. That's nice. And if you, you're going to have a little bit left over underneath. Ah, let's garnish it on top. There we go. Okay, here's the dish. Barbecue macaroni and cheese shepherd's pie. I'm John Stage. This is Dude Food. Don't forget to subscribe. Watch as Top Chef Spike Mendelson gets wasted with Palm Springers and rewards them with a delicious meal. Hangover not included. Every morning you wake up to an important decision. Bacon or donuts. This morning you can have both. The maple donut. Taste the bacony donut deliciousness. Bagel heads, the death of the Twinkie, and foul holiday flavored vodkas. Get your news on the food feeder and then watch Noah and Why Would You Eat That's Michael Truly Feed the Office. Native to Jamaica, Aki is a toxic, poisonous fruit, and eating it could kill you. Now watch us chow down. Oversalted your soup? Don't throw it out. Use this amazing food trick instead. Watch Foundry Chef Eric Greenspan make his award-winning grilled cheese sandwich and learn his secrets. Subscribe for free. Your tummy will thank you.